my story revolves a lot, a lot around family. Um, I went to church as a kid, a teenager, but as an adult, I got away from that. After high school, I joined the military, got married, had kids. Things were kind of tough for a while there. Uh, me and my wife both wanted to get back into going to church. We were very, uh, pretty poor, having a difficult time making men's meet. And we avoided daycare by raising our kids ourselves. When one of us wasn't working, the other one was. The downside to that was that we had no free time. Uh, we didn't even have time for each other. We never had a day off together. Um, and when we made the move to Oregon to have a change of pace in our lifestyle so we could have more time for each other. Um, but a few weeks after we moved here, she died. My kids were very young at the time, so I spent the next 15 years raising them on my own. I felt to drive or a pull to find a new church somewhere, but I was so busy being a full-time dad. Eventually, the kids grew up, they left home to start their own lives. My youngest left home two years ago. I didn't know what I was gonna do with myself. Although I still felt that drive to go to a church, any church, but I didn't know where to go. And then one day I found out about Family Church. I was driving around town one day and I, I saw a bumper sticker on a car. And that's how I found out about the church. So I gave it a shot. I showed up one Sunday and I immediately made two friends, uh, Jack and Teresa. And they, they really made me feel welcome. And I kept coming back. I liked the people, I liked the message I was hearing. And I felt like I belonged here, like this is the right place for me. Something I'd been looking for for a long time. And that's, that's why I've, I've continued coming back. Now, I never thought about being baptized before. Uh, I wanted to go back to a church for many years, but that never occurred to me to do that until I started coming here. Um, after I'd been here for a few months, I decided that's what I want for me. I want to do that. I feel like that's the next natural step for me. Um, so that's why I want to do this. This is Russ. I'm going to pray for Russ. I want to thank you for Russ. Just the journey he's been on. The journey that has included suffering and hurt. But through it, he has seen you in your presence, Lord. Thank you that you have walked with him during the valleys of life. And that you have guided him to a place where he has a relationship with you. Thank you that you can work through something as small as a bumper sticker. To help people grow relationship, help people to, to see your work in their life. Lord, I pray that Russ continues his steps of faith, that he continues growing in you. Thank you. Amen. All right. All right, guys. <clears throat> Russ, I baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, buried like Jesus, born again to walk with you. <laughs>